I noticed right away that I could climb very well under pressure. I liked competing. At age 18, I think I made it to my first World Cup final. I have like 25 to 30 podiums. I've climbed more than 150 international competitions. I won the overall World Cup, which was a very big goal for me. The success, the five minutes of fame are not what I did it for. The decision to stop competition climbing, I never knew when to take it. Kata helped me a whole bunch. It seemed so obvious to her. I used to love going to comps, but I just lost the bit of psych you need for it the last two years. I've learned what gets me psyched, and now that I've made the decision to stop competing, I feel more in peace with myself. The chapter is done now, and I can focus on rock climbing. I've kind of been transitioning towards a more outside experience. It's the first trip where we're officially retired from competition. Climbing outside now, especially tread climbing, I haven't done any of it before. And it's something totally new and I can learn so much. So Yosemite is famous for its big walls. But nobody ever talks about the single pitch tread climb. Decided to focus on hard single pitch tread climbs. I have so many goals, it's basically like an endless playground. The biggest challenge for me in track climbing is lacing the gear and especially trusting the gear. Like I'm always scared that if I fall, the gear comes out and I'm on the ground. hopping all over the valley to try the best track climbs. Even though it's my fifth time in Yosemite, I can still climb on five-star track climbs. generation they spend more and more time inside and less time outside and um, so I think for them it will be getting harder to keep themselves motivated especially year after year a lot of people are scared of retiring from comp climbing because there's like this black hole coming afterwards they don't really know where to go to but there's so many routes to climb and you don't have time to fall into the hole there's always something there to do the experiences i've had from outdoor climbing have always been more memorable than even victories on competition climbing 